Hello everyone. We are here to meet the Duke family tonight. <laughs> <laughs> and they are going to tell us a little bit about themselves. We're going to start with, we'll start with Mama Duke on the end. I'm Eva Duke. <laughs> no, I'm Sarah Duke. He means Sarah Eva Duke. <laughs> okay. Oh, mine's Colby Duke. Tell her. Yeah, go ahead and tell us about you, Colby. How old are you? Where do you go to school? I'm 14. I go to school. Okay. Hi, my name is Clay, and I'm nine, and I go to East Chip Elementary School. Okay. And I'm Stevie Duke, and I'm 42, <laughs> and I go to work. <laughs> That's a good thing. So, uh, first, Colby and Clay, you guys, uh, each of you tell us, like, what you do at school, what uh, sports you're involved in, or just what you do to have fun. I I play softball and I like to ride forward, ride horses, hunt, fish, and that kind of stuff. Busy. Uh 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 my name is Walton. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I like to ride forward and dirt bikes and I like to fish and hunt. Mmm. Have you been hunting lately? Oh, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, have you been hunting lately? Have y'all been hunting lately? Yeah. Is it any it's kind of hunting good. season? Okay. It's okay. But they go fish another week, and every time they throw their line out, they catch something. I caught 30 and fish for about an hour and a half, two hours. There. I caught, Wow, Mr. Dale's gonna want to go fishing with you guys. I bet he kept up with it. Okay, um, first question: How did you guys end up at Clarksville Highway Church? Always. Which will be different for you two because it's before you were married. Yeah, I always went there ever since I was a baby. I guess. Mm -hmm. so. I've always been there, and then when we got married, we went to Good Springs uh, for a little while where he uh, grew up at, and then we came back to Fox so, Well, well because was, we moved, I mean, we moved up here, yeah. it's closer to go to the Clark Highway, even though Good Springs was no just that. right down there. There was other reasons <laughs> we didn't get into that. Uh -huh. We were bad No. We just felt like we were growing more. Okay, awesome. And how long have you guys been there? I guess. 2010. Okay. 14. No, 14. That's not 13. I'm on 14. Ever 13. since you were a baby. Yeah. <laughs> I've been there pretty much my whole life. And so, what do you guys like to do for fun? Read. <laughs> like That's three. a good one. <laughs> Blue reading. Any kind, any kind of, uh, any kind of book or thing that you like to read? Not really. The yes. Bible. Yeah. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> we we, we uh, told what to say. <laughs> no. Uh, no, but yeah, I like to read. I like to run. I like to. Crash bikes. I love photography. Uh -huh. Do what? Crash bikes. Crash bikes. I can't ride a bike. So. <laughs> he knows a lot about you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Your turn. I like to hunt and fish with my kids, camp, and I like to ride motorcycles. Mm -hmm. About anything you can do outdoors is what I like to do. Shut well, that's what you guys were for. <laughs> so, um, you shared that your favorite verse was Mark eleven twenty four. Mm -hmm. So, what do you have a reason that that is your favorite verse, or what is it? Why did you pick that verse? Mm, it's just a good verse. Mm -hmm. 
it just. Well, I should have told you I was going to ask you that. Well, <laughs> it it just it gives you faith or hope that when God hears you, He's going to answer. Or when you're going through something and you pray about it, you know that He's got your back and He's going to take care of you. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. That helps me because I have to write a devotional on that. And I thought, I want to make sure that I'm thinking about it the way that person is thinking about it. Yeah. Um, what about you, Stevie? Do you have a favorite verse or I something? I certainly that you... have a favorite verse. Me and Eva were talking about it earlier. I, I don't necessarily have a favorite verse, but there's like verses I like to think of that I live by. And it's Hebrews 13, verse 16, I think. It's just talking about how you need to serve others. And oh, uh, God, God is pleased when you serve others and you know, help somebody out. You know, I feel like, I, like that's what I'm called to do. So. Uh-huh. That's a great verse. I, I may do one on that one instead. <laughs> that will be easier. <laughs> What about you guys? Do you have a favorite Bible story or favorite verse that you like? My favorite verse is Philippians 4, 13. I can do all things in Christ. Really? My, my mind is too. She doesn't even know that verse. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite Bible story? Uh, uh, the one where God died on the cross. The one where God died on the cross. Oh, good one. <laughs> That's good. That's the most important one. Uh, that is Mr. Charlie's favorite verse, too, Colby. Mr. Charlie Moffat. He told me. That's a good one. I've got to write one on that, too. I think I'm going to get y'all's whole family here on the verses. So is there anything that you think that you guys have done as a family, uh, or even individually, that you think has really, like, helped you grow either spiritually or, you know, just more connected as a family. And you guys might have an answer to that, too. I just say that the family part of campus. And yeah. It is an important part for me, I know. It's a youth group, like, for all of our little trips, you know, they're, they're pretty nice. Mm-hmm. That's interesting, Camping. Well, we had a men's retreat a few years back, and I felt like I got a lot out of it. So what was it? We, we Did you actually go a, stay somewhere? Yeah, it was our church. We went to a place up in Dover. Lampton Lake. We went to Lampton Lake. I'm pretty sure it was where we were Stayed at a, like a little resort or something there, I guess. So. Mm -hmm. Huh. So, there, and I guess there was a theme for the weekend, and yeah, it was just me. just learned a lot about people you really didn't know. You know, everybody kind of, you know, told the whole life story in a kind of way. And, mm, okay. It, it's good to see a lot of people kind of like myself, kind of rough around the edges. Well, people from church, <laughs> yeah. but, you know, yeah. saw them at church. They didn't really see them outside church. Right. And so they kind of got to know each other more and their story and everything. Yeah, that's cool. Mm -hmm. Um, what about you? Because you put me on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> I should have. Yeah, I should have told you. I'll remember it. I'll think of something after you leave. <laughs> <laughs> um, let me. All right. Thank you guys very much for uh, letting us in your home, telling us a little bit about yourself. And I just wanted to add that one of the things I love about y'all's family is. Um, just your genuineness and how you're always inviting people to church. Uh, like you want your friends to come, you know, you want them to know Jesus, you love them. And um, I was teasing everybody the other day because we were talking about Camp Bacon. And I said, okay, last year, everybody at Camp Bacon was in third grade because it was all of Clay's <laughs> friends that he invited. So I feel like this year, everybody will be in fourth grade at Camp Bacon. <laughs> But um, I do appreciate that a lot about y'all. So you can tell everybody goodbye. Thank Bye. you. Good signing out. <laughs>